watching MCS TV where we dare to be extraordinary. I'm Abigail Munoz. And I am Charles Torres. And today, I'd like to wish everyone a happy new year. As today is the first show after the winter break, we hope everyone had a safe and enjoyable holiday. I caught up with Principal Dr. Goodwin for his hopes and expectations for the students this coming year. But we are just raring to go here in 2013, and the students, uh, I expect great things from the students. Uh, we're having Saturday school, we're having uh, all kinds of activities after school every day, but this year is going to be an outstanding day, and um, we're really going to put, we're going to put uh, Met Met's Charter School on the map this year. And just a reminder that Saturday tutoring will resume this Saturday, January 5th, from 9 a.m. to 12 noon at Metz Charter School. Hope to see you there. This year's 8th grade graduating class of 2013 are preparing for the big transition into high school. Recently, the 8th graders got all glammed up and posed for the capping gown photos. Our Angeli Serrano was on the scene. Angeli? Hi, I'm Angie Serrano, and I'm here with Crystal Cruz, who finally finished taking her picture for graduation. So how does it feel finally taking a graduation picture? It feels exciting. It feels like finally I get to graduate and be grown. <laughs> so since um, graduation's almost here, um, are you excited? Are you nervous? Like, how do you feel? I'm nervous because I know a lot of my friends aren't going to be here next year and I'm probably going to be alone, but I'm really excited for it too. So since um, graduation is only a few months away, are you excited? I'm Yeah, I'm excited because I know it's a step to get into high school and I'm proud of it. Metz Charter School is wishing the 8th grade class, class 2013 the best of luck. Graduation is on June 28, 2013. I'm Angelie Serrano and back to the studio. Also, Mets would like to congratulate 6th grade student Joshua Villa, who is one of three students chosen to sing Don't Stop Believing by Journey at a New York Knicks-Chicago Bulls basketball game on Friday, December 21st. Our Peter Ibrahim caught up with Joshua for an exclusive interview. Peter? Thanks, Abigail. I'm Peter here with Joshua Villa, the 6th grade Mets Charter School student who was chosen to sing at the Knicks versus Bulls game. Congratulations. Thank um, you. So, tell me about getting selected. How did that happen? Um, my singing teacher helped me. She told me about this, and I went to Manhattan, and I auditioned for it. What was it like? Were you nervous? How did it feel? Um, there was a lot of people, but I wasn't that nervous since I couldn't really see anyone's faces. But it was really fun, and I was really happy. Um, and after, how did you feel like? Did you feel accomplished? What was going through your head while you were doing it and basically after? Um... I was very happy, obviously. I won $500, so I worked very hard for it, and I won, so it was worth it. All right, so thank you for being with us, and thank you for representing Met Charter School. Hundreds of kids auditioned for this honor to sing at the basketball game, and we are so proud that Joshua was picked to sing. And a congratulations to him for winning the $500 prize. This won't be the last time we'll see Joshua, as he is now part of a bigger contest in which he is expected to sing again at an upcoming game. We'll keep you updated. And lastly, before the year ended, Mets Charter School teamed up with the Jersey City Fire Department to bring a little bit of cheer to the less fortunate in our city. Our Angeli Serrano caught up with some of the firefighters coordinating the toy drive. Angeli? Hi, I'm Angeli Serrano, and I'm here with the Fire Department, Jersey City, uh, picking up those donated toys for Toys for Tots. So how does it feel for, um, for our school to actually donate these toys for you guys? It's a wonderful feeling. We're so happy that you guys were able to help out all the needy children of Jersey City. And from uh, Jersey City Fire Department to you guys, we thank you very much. And you're welcome. Um, so where are these toys actually going for? Um, the needy in Jersey City, there's uh, homeless kids from St. Lucie's that uh, get toys and anybody that was displaced by the storm. We just want to say thank you very, very much. You did a great job. And uh, the toys really come in handy this year. There's so many people at need. And uh, this year, I believe we're going to be doing almost 1,600 children throughout the city with your help. And thanks to the students and staff who helped collect dozens of toys from Barbies to Hot Wheels, helping to provide a Merry Christmas to kids throughout the city. I caught up with 10th grade student Brianna Thomas, who helped to wrap many of the donated gifts. 
it makes you feel good because I get to um, experience how how the kids felt when they didn't have presents. So you know, it's my duty to try to help them and help the firefighters. That's all the time we have for today. Thanks for watching Mets Charter School TV, where we dare to be extraordinary. I'm Charles Torres. And I'm Abigail Munoz, and we'll see you next week on MCS TV.